Terrifying moments when bullets fly through a Germantown apartment and tonight police are trying to find the shooters. Hi there, I'm Shay Arthur. Greg and Stephanie are off tonight. WREG's Andrew Ellison joins us live in the medical district. And Andrew, you spoke with a man who lives at that apartment. What did he have to say about this scary ordeal? Yeah, well, first and foremost, he's glad and thankful his baby boy isn't here at Labonner Children's Hospital because he says one of the bullets barely missed him. They start shooting. This father is on edge because the gunmen who fired into his Germantown apartment are still on the streets tonight. The incident so upsetting he prefers not to be identified. It's very serious. Police say it happened Sunday afternoon when men in a black Nissan Maxima came to the Farmington Gates apartments at Poplar and Briarbrook Road. Investigators say they fired several shots into this unit. I was sleeping in my room when that happened. I, I was thinking about firework. I woke up like, you know, who's doing firework here by now? I said, no, that's a gunshot. He says one of the bullets struck his car while another went through this window and barely missed his year and a half old son. He was uh, playing in his toys. He came through the window all the way inside the closet. And he calls the whole thing a bad mix up claiming the shooters were actually after his upstairs neighbor who wasn't home at the time. I think they was thinking like she lived downstairs. She came after 30 minutes. She said uh, someone called her and uh, threatened her. He want to kill her. She said a friend or something. Whatever the case, he hopes police catch the shooters soon, fearing they might come back. I hope I don't pay for something. I don't have nothing to do with it so, from other people. I mean, this situation, I don't have nothing to do with it. They came to the wrong apartment. Grateful his wife and five children are okay. At least I have my kids, you know. I don't worry about myself more than I worry about my kids. Yeah, certainly a case we'll stay on top of. By the way, we tried to talk to that man's upstairs neighbor, but apartment management told us we had to get off the property. Live in the medical district, Andrew Ellison, WRG News, Channel 3.